Hi everyone, welcome to camglish.com. This is Teacher Reyes and I am going to be your teacher in learning and discovering new words using the book Seeing and Reading Solution Intermediate. So are you ready to expand your vocabulary skills, comprehension skills, improve your pronunciation skills as well as your speaking skills? Alright, so let's start. So for today, we are going to discuss something about Unit 17. So before we read the caption, can you please tell me first what do you see on the picture? Are you familiar with this guy? Okay, well actually in the first picture, as you can see, this guy is playing a musical in a musical instrument. So what do you think is this musical instrument that he's playing? Okay, very good. So this instrument is actually a cello. Alright, so do you know what to call the person Who's playing cello? Okay, so when you Okay, so that person is actually what you call a cellist. Okay? Alright, so as you can see this guy is a cellist. And not just an ordinary cellist, but a very famous one. Okay, so let us read this caption now. So I will be reading this one. So you have to listen very well on how I pronounce each of the words. Okay, so let's read. In an interview with CNN, internationally acclaimed cellist Yo-Yo Ma talks about his childhood and how he connects with people through his music. Again, in an interview with CNN, internationally acclaimed cellist Yo-Yo Ma talks about his childhood and how he connects with people through his music. Alright, so before you read this one, do you know the word acclaim? Alright, so when you say acclaim, this means publicly praised. So that person is considered publicly praised or that person is being celebrated. Alright, so now kindly read the caption once again. Okay, very good. So there you go. So of course this guy is named Yoyoma. So he will be going he'll going to be our topic for this article. So before we read the article, let us first discuss the following words you'll see in there. Alright, so here are your vocabulary words. So let's start with the first word. Span. Again, span. So when you say span, it means to include all of a period of time. Alright, or also, span is just the full extent of something from end to end. It can also be the amount of space that something covers. Okay, next is tutelage. Again, tutelage. So this one means responsibility for someone's education, actions, or property. Alright? So it can also be a protection of or authority over someone or something. It can also be like a guardianship. Okay? 
Next is collaborate with. Again, collaborate with. When you say collaborate with, it means you're going to work together with a person or a group in order to achieve something. So you will be working with a person or a group. So all together you will do that work. Next is inspire. Again, inspire. So inspire is to encourage someone by making them feel eager to do something. Or also when you say inspire it means to feel someone with the urge or ability to do or feel something, especially to do creative or to do something creative. Alright, next is get through. Again, get through. Or when you get through something, it means to come successfully to the end of an unpleasant experience or period of time. It means you were able to survive a very unpleasant experience. Okay, next pull through again pull through okay this means to succeed in doing something very difficult it means you were able to survive something that is very challenging or very hard to do next switch to again switch to it means to change suddenly or completely from one thing to another so it can be to a person who will be changing his or her personality okay next is Disaster. Again, disaster. Alright, so when you say disaster, it is something that is very bad or a failure. So it's also like when everything is a total mess. Okay, next about, what about this word? This one is discipline. Again, discipline. Okay, when someone is disciplined, it means that person obeys rules and control your behavior. So someone who can manipulate you easily. So someone that you need to obey or to follow. Next is gratifying. Again, gratifying. So when you say gratifying, it means giving pleasure by taking care of a need or desire. Or it can also be satisfying. Next is parallel. Again, parallel. So it means being the same distance apart along all their land. Alright, so we're done with this one. So again, let's read all the words. Span, tutelage, collaborate with, inspire, get through, pull through, switch to, disaster, disciplined,
gratifying parallel alright so those are the words that you need to remember so again I'll see you on my next video goodbye